Well, as many of our viewers know, we've been hearing a lot about the ancient ruins over the last few weeks, and we recently sent Commander Adidane right out there to investigate. That's not quite right, Butch. You sent me to the mean system to secretly investigate the comings and goings of an engineer called Ram Tar. Anyway, upon docking at Felice Dock, Ram Tar messaged me directly. My cover was blown. He must have known I was coming. <laughs> but hold on. Shouldn't you at this point warn the viewers about something, Commander? Yeah, okay, maybe. In this report, I'll be visiting the ancient ruins. You may like to turn off now if you fancy visiting the ruins yourself. Can we go on now? Sure! In his message, he wanted me to go and find out about some non-human ancient ruins that he had recently discovered, and he was offering 100 million credits for any information about these guardians, he called them. I found it odd that his message didn't include any information about the location of the ruins. You'd have thought that if he knew the location, he'd tell me. Anyway, asking other sources, I managed to find out the system and the planet coordinates. Upon arrival, I performed a flyby to understand the geography and to get a feel for the place. Sound doesn't travel in space, but there was a very eerie spooky sound coming from the area, as though ghosts from the ancient past were watching me. I landed next to some strange pillars or obelisks and went over to investigate. As I approached, some of them started to glow. I must say Butch, at this point I was very freaked out. And my flight suit told me that a little bit of wee had come out. Face to face with an obelisk, I scanned it. Which must have done something because it stopped glowing and throbbing. And I got a message from Ram Tar telling me that I'm not doing it right. I wasn't quite sure I understood what Ram was on about. Was he telling me that I needed to fill my cargo bay with fish or something? I soon discovered various ancient items lying around. If I didn't discover anything else, at the very least I could tell Ram that the Guardians were a messy lot who didn't care for anything of value. These items had some form of technology unknown to us. A technology created by the species of a superior intelligence than our own. A technology that makes the invention of faster than light travel look like something the Wright brothers invented. Well, that's a statement and a half, Commander. What makes you say that? Because when you approach these ancient artifacts, they glowed. And storing them in the cargo bay allowed me to somehow communicate with the obelisks to reveal information about their creators. That is cool technology. Over the course of a few days, I found various ancient items, from orbs to totems to urns. Urns? What, tea urns? Dead urns? Space urns? Urns? What, like, dead stuff? Was there anything dead inside them? Ash or dust or something? Good God, is there anything we could get a DNA sample of? Nah, nothing I could see. However, the orb did make for a good football. Maybe we should send some over to be used in the Colonial Olympics. The various places around the ruins are these mysterious pillars, which sprung up from the ground when I approached them. I managed to scan them, but couldn't figure out what they did, so I shot them. This released an ancient artifact to be added to my collection. It then dawned on me what Ram had been hinting at. Certain combinations of stored ancient items in the cargo bay would reveal valuable information about the Guardians. But with so many items and obelisks, I figured that there were just too many combinations that I could be bothered with. Being a bit late to this party, it just so happens that other commanders and organisations, such as Canon Research, have already figured all this out. So, using the provided research, I scanned each pillar to reveal a wealth of information about the ancient guardians. I mean, like what, Commander? I mean, these guardians, are they like slugs with hairy armpits or some kind of giant purple slime-covered octopus? Or what? No, I... <laughs> That I don't know, but uh, a few things I picked up were, apparently they watched a lot of porn. You gotta be shitting me, Commander. And spoke with a Geordie accent. 
Mostly they communicate visually rather than verbally using sign language. Rocket technology was considered a huge pollutant but they heavily used biological warfare and they developed AI implants which accelerated their technology for them to reach true sentient singularity. Oh okay commander but no slugs, no hairy armpits, no octopuses? I'm a bit disappointed. <laughs> so heading back to Mean, I handed over all my information that I'd found earning me 12 million credits. Just 12 million? What happened to the 100 million, Commander? Yeah, well I guess I need to visit the other four ancient ruins to earn that amount. Well, thank you, Commander. Now back over the gym in the studio with the latest news from the uh, 20th century mummified Pizza Hut expedition. If you enjoyed watching this video, please do give it a thumbs up or drop a comment below. And don't forget to subscribe for more videos.